all right this is the video that i needed to film and i didn't want to film it but i have to because y'all going too far at this point so here we are here we are back sitting down in the same spot about to film it, but i'm about to sip my coffee real quick because i didn't even get to sip on it and i'm about to make this video quick because my babies are getting up they're chill but they're getting up from like a morning nap so now Okay, I get y'all motherfuckers don't want to see it. Let me rephrase that. Mm -hmm. I get you people don't want to see me happy. I get it. I get y'all don't want to see me happy. I get y'all love to see me sad, depressed, frustrated, all that stuff. I get it. It's entertaining. But now that I'm happy, it's like, damn, it's getting, I'm getting hit harder. So, as you guys know, CPS came to my house yesterday. This is the next day. CPS came to my house, and that man was so just frustrated about everything. He was just like, why are these people calling, saying that, you that your, your, your child pooped everywhere and smeared it all over the house, saying that you um, your house is just so just gross, and he's looking around like, I just it disgusting messages showing I had to show this man my apartment the fact that I have a two-story apartment and if I go downstairs and my kids are upstairs it's just like me having a two-story house I don't gotta be upstairs you know what I'm saying it's two stories okay with that said I'm dealing with that but they're gonna close the case but I'm also dealing with other stuff now my apartment manager she said that it's been happening for a while so people are gonna say oh it's because your address my address obviously has been leaked since i basically moved here or i guess you want to say for a while but she only sent me i think she sent me only two she sent me two emails that said because you forward them to me so you know i can i'm trying to get a case and she's like okay she forwarded them to me she sent me two emails she sent me one that was in the summer and one that was recent but obviously there's more it's not just emails she said they've been getting a lot of harassing phone calls about me and you know she said she wouldn't come to me with this information if she didn't feel like it was concerning you know that she didn't know what was really going on she knew i was a youtuber they understand that but she was like something ain't right let me go ahead and just call her is they doing too much at this point and she said they tried to call the numbers back and they're calling from anonymous numbers and the emails are fake and you know they don't know what to do at this point and i feel bad i feel so bad that i'm ready to just pack all my shit and leave and not only that i don't like that y'all are doing this much it makes me uncomfortable and when i say that i mean like i'm so uncomfortable that i, I i'm afraid for my children at this point Cause I feel like y'all will go to the whole nine yards, meaning y'all will probably come to my apartments and sit outside and watch me from the woods. Like that's how uncomfortable I am. And I know people are gonna say, Jasmine, you're just a, you only got 45K subscribers, pause. Thank you so much for 45K. Thank you so much for everybody that subscribed and came to my channel. Whether you love me or hate me, I appreciate your view and your subscribe and your subscribe. I appreciate your view and you subscribing to my channel and supporting us. But some of y'all are going too far. And I'm not sitting here trying to say I'm a celebrity, but y'all are acting as if I am. I ain't acting like that. I tell, like I say every time, I am a human being. Although these other celebrities are human, I feel like I'm just a regular person. A regular person from Austin, Texas. Y'all know. I am not like your normal, I feel like I'm not like your normal YouTuber. You see all these other YouTubers and they're kind of just, like, you know, they're all glammy and type YouTubers. I'm not that kind of person. This is your, I feel like I'm way different from all other YouTubers. I have a different kind of swag, a different kind of way that I move. I'm not the same. I'm not like your average YouTuber and that's probably why a lot of y'all can relate to me. You know what I'm saying? With that said, y'all make it seem like I'm a celebrity. Especially the ones that are going the extra nine yards to 
hurt me but not using their head and calling CPS they're saying oh I'm concerned but at the end of the day they're not concerned because of what they're doing they're harassing my apartments calling sending emails so she did send me I'm gonna talk about the one that she sent me from the summer she says here is the email from the summer I hope I hope you get it all sorted out I'm so sorry that you're dealing with this Basically, it says all my information and she said, how do they know all this? I said, you know, they know my name. All it takes is for you to look it up. You look up my name, you gon you're not you gonna find whatever you find, okay? And whatever. So questions slash comments. You might want to keep this as proof for the list of okay, backtracks. I can barely see. You might want to keep this as proof for the list of complaints that your email that you emailed your tenant, Jasmine the priest That's my middle name. Where's Dupes? She was so shocked. She was like, they know your middle name? Yeah, the priest um, Also, the children have flooded the townhouse multiple times. If anything ever happened, look, I'm the... <laughs> I'm the type of occupant that if something, the smallest thing, and they know the smallest thing is wrong with my house, they get a message, text message. Like my freezer wasn't working. They were here. Whenever they locked the doors, they were here. When the toys flooded, not when the toys overflowed, they were here instantly, okay? It's not like I'm just letting my house go. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I have, and she's like, you have toddlers, you know, toddlers do things. I was like, you know, they have, and y'all know, because y'all come all the time. And she said, you know, yeah, it came. And she said she started to put two and two together once they started getting pl complaints and people were trying to lie and say that it was uh, other tenants here. But she was like, they not, when they started getting complaints, there was no emails, like real emails, no real numbers. And they started using that. And they were like, okay, somebody's faking shit. They recognize it. I'm glad that they do because that shit is really, can fuck me and my kids up. Y'all can literally take the roof over my and it's cold here 30 degrees y'all can take the roof over my kids head doing all this that i don't know who would want to do that to somebody to children or them in general i don't know i don't know but i feel like y'all do going out your way for no reason i'm like damn are you another man maybe that i just said i'm not gonna fuck with you or something is that you? Is, is, that what, is that who you are? Thought about that. I thought about all kinds of stuff. Because, like, who would go through this extra link? Like, I, did I hurt you? Because I know I was a, a dog to people, and I was just like, you know, I don't care. So I was like, maybe it's another man. But then I was like, maybe it's just a reactor. And I say reactors because, you know what? At the end of the day, y'all get up on YouTube, and y'all use my name, and y'all drag it so much. I feel like y'all would do something like that. I feel like y'all would get on here and try to hurt another woman because you just don't like her or her content and you're jealous. You're obviously jealous. I don't give a damn what you say. Obviously you're jealous. If you're, you're sitting here and you're posting negative content and that's not all reactors, let's get that clear. Let's be, let's not say reactors. Let's not say reactors because a reactor is somebody that comes with facts and leave an opening question. Let's say trolls, I just spit, I'm sorry. Let's say trolls. All right, my camera is on, but let's say trolls. Let's say, I want to call you a bully, whoever. Because like I said, a reactor is a person to leave an opening question at the end of the of their reaction. Um, so, it's, it's sickening, you know? And whoever you are, I really wish you could leave me alone. I ain't did shit to you. Damn, if you wanted a shout out, here it is. Cloud Chaser, Tasha TMR, the man that's on YouTube, whoever you are, that keeps putting videos of me and you're a whole man. Whoever the hell y'all are, all y'all. Uh, blah my East, there is your shout out. There you go. There you mother go. I hope you enjoyed it. Go subscribe. Comment on their channel. So I'm pretty sure their comments are open. So go comment. And if it is them, let them know if it's you. You're a low down dirty person.
It's crazy, man. There's your shout out. Make sure you use hashtag my jazzy life sent me to your channel. Cause they want that shout out. They want that publicity. Here you go. I'm giving it to you. Now leave my kids alone. I'm saying kids because this has it's more than just me. You know what I'm saying? You're fucking with more than just me. You're fucking with my kids. Their house. When you contact my apartments, you fucking with my kids. You're fucking with their roof over their head. Now you're doing too much. The next email. She sent me, um, she said there are, she said there's more videos, or more videos, more messages, but she sent me one and it says, just thought you should be aware that the tenant, the tenant in 1421 has a man with a criminal record living with her and her young children and he is not on a lease. Let's get one thing clear. And that was, I think, bef either before Chris came into the picture. Let me get one thing clear. I'm 29 years old. I have a boyfriend. My boyfriend comes and visits me. He, ha he stays somewhere else. He comes and visit, meaning as if I go to Chrissy's house and visit and spend a night, who gives a fuck? How you feel? Okay, do you, do you hear me? Who gives a fuck? How you feel? He does not live here. He does not have a criminal background. And I'm guessing they're talking about my kid's dad. And that's why I was telling her, I said, I think that, you know, because there's a lot of them from the summer too, apparently, they were talking about Philip. Phil doesn't live here. Clearly, he's in jail. He's in jail. He's been in jail for three years. I had to tell her, like, he's been in jail for three years. Chris is around. He makes me happy. Does he live here? No. I guess I gotta come on here and be completely blunt with y'all. No, he doesn't. Does he come, spend a night here and there? Yes. He also works. So, you're not gonna, you see him, but you don't see him. Sometimes you see him, and then you're not gonna see him later on or something like that. You know what I'm saying? We want to move forward and eventually live together, but right now we're taking shit slow. I don't see what's wrong with that. What's wrong with that? What's wrong with me living in the moment and being happy with this man? What's wrong with it? Calling the office for what? What? What are you trying? What are you gaining from all this? I really, really want to know. What are you gaining? Cause you know what? If it's something I can give you, shit, I'll give it to you. If you want a damn cookie, here you go. <laughs> and I can sense in her voice she was so annoyed. She was so annoyed, you know, given that people keep calling and emailing her. I feel bad. I personally feel bad. Like, that shit woke me up. I was already tired and it woke me up. Like, at first I wasn't sleep. I was sleeping and I was like, I'm gonna shut chill. It woke me the fuck up. I feel bad for her. I feel bad that they happen to go through this. And I kept saying that I stressed it. I'm sorry you're having to go through this. And cloud chasers, shut the fuck up. Stop saying I'm leaving my babies in their room. First of all, during nap time, yes, you're going to your room. That's all my kids. I don't know where, how y'all do y'all's life with y'all's children. I don't care how you do it, but this always been like that in my house. From Kaylee. Nap time, you're going to your room. You get in trouble, you're going to your room. <laughs> you if you want to play, if I'm cooking and you're doing too much out here while I'm cooking, you're going into your room or you can go outside on the porch because my porch is a closed porch. It's not like you can fall through a rail. I don't mind. Take my camera, turn it around. I can see from my phone, go to the porch. That is not like they in there all the time. Right now, they're probably taking a nap, but as soon as I finish filming this video, they're going to come out here. I got, I'm finna print off the coloring sheets that I just pulled out for them. I just don't get why people are so pressed about what's my, what my move's about. My apartment is a two story apartment, okay? And I had to tell her, I said, people don't even think that my apartment's two stories. They think that I'm leaving my apartment and I'm going, I have a separate garage somewhere else and I'm going somewhere else when I'm going to my garage and I'm leaving my kids here. I said, it's like I'm a, a damn two story house. I could go downstairs. Hell, 
I'm gonna convert my downstairs into a living room. Well, shit, that's if I stay here. I could go downstairs. It's not hurting anybody. Is it hurting you? Please tell me. If it's hurting you that I'm going downstairs, please tell me and then click off my video. Just don't even watch. Because I don't wanna hurt you. I don't wanna fuck with you. I don't wanna fuck with your vibes or any of that. This shit really got me hot. Contacted my landlord. That's you you're at this point you're just doing way too much. Way too much. I'm saying landlord, apartment manager, whatever, all that same thing. And you know, Chrissy went through this shit and I now I feel it. I see, you know, some people don't want to deal with that shit. And they just be like, you know what, uh-uh. That's I feel that. I feel what she's going through. And Chrissy's like, damn, are they doing all this extra because you got a man? Like, who does that? Like, do you go harass your mom because she's in a relationship with somebody? She, she broke, your, your mom and dad broke up years ago and you finally found somebody, do you harass her? Please tell me, I, you know. All right, y'all, my camera's about to die. And I'm about to end this, so, like I said, please stop. You're hurting my kids. You're, you're messing with their house, you know, their house. The roof over their head, you're messing with it, just stop. You're doing too much, okay? I shouldn't get calls from my apartments, talking about they're getting calls from people with fake numbers and fake emails, and that's too much. And she's like, can we get a case again? She's questioning me, like, can we open up a case? And I'm like, send me the stuff, we'll figure it out. You know, they already have a case open. Maybe they can figure it out. Maybe they need to get their cyber fucking people into this and figure it out. Part of me is like, damn, my mood is like, it's like a part of it's like I just need to get a lawyer. I need to get so I need a lawyer up for situations like this. But you know, I'm like, damn. Okay, look, I'm dying for real. I'm really dying. But I mean, I'm like, I'm not there yet. But anyways, please stop. At the end of the day, I love y'all. The ones that love me and support me and love me for who I am. I love y'all. Camera about to die and keeps cutting off. I will see y'all in my next video. Chris does not stay here. Let me just end this video with that. Okay? He's here to help me when I need it and just to be around me to visit because he loves me. He doesn't stay here. God damn, let a bitch be happy. Period, poo. Period. Drink to that. Drink to happiness. I really hope that this helps you. Okay, let me. I hope that, you know, you fix yourself. Hi, this message is for the um, management. One of your residents, um, Jasmine Dukes in Unit 1421, she has an adult occupant that's not listed on the lease um, living with her, and he's not somebody you would want in your community. Have a good day.